You're talking stocks with Nora the Stock Explorer. Hey guys, welcome back. It's Nora the Stock Explorer, guys. Guess what? We're going to go back one year ago yesterday, and I'm going to show you what I was talking about, and then we're going to see how those stocks did that I talked about in this very video right here. It's called Neo Stock FOMO and Advice Midweek Talk Apple and GM Stock. Let's look at how Apple and GM did. Of course, we're going to talk about Tesla Maesla as well. So let's get into it. Let's see what I was talking about a year ago yesterday, guys. Check it out. How's my friends out there? This is Nora coming to you with the midweek little advice for the midweek trading and investing action. Guys, listen, be very careful out there with this NEO. NEO is running up straight on FOMO, which is fear of missing out. People are jumping in because they think they're not going to get a good price. Listen, in the high 40s, that is not a good price. And you know that a lot of huge investors at any moment, such as the banks, can dump this stock and leave you holding the bag, guys. Listen, be safe. Diversify your accounts, okay? Don't throw all your money in one stock because you think it's the next big thing, the next Tesla or what have you. I don't have any. All right, guys. Let's have a look at NEO. All right. There's a little sneak preview of Ford, but let's look at Neo. Let's see what it did. Let's see what it did on the year. I don't think you're going to be too impressed, guys. I'll just spoiler alert, okay? On the year, Neo was negative 16.61. I use Robinhood because it has a very... Uh, easy to use interface where you can go back and look at the chart a year ago and a year ago a year ago it was trading up here in the 40 45 46 look at what it's at today guys less than it was a year ago okay I just want to bring this to your attention you're going to always see people on YouTube pumping up Neo now they do that because people are interested in it but why I have no idea guys I just had Ford up let's have a look at Ford guys it's really simple um, you can't trust the media always because look Ford on the year if you had bought Ford a year ago let's look at the one year very different uh, chart look at that for the most part, we're going up and to the right, guys. That slow, consistent gain. We're up 136% on the year. Okay, not negative. 136%. You would have doubled your money with Ford, but nobody's making YouTube videos about Ford. Well, they are, but not as many as you see with neo let's look at gm which is another stock that i had spoken about in this very video gm did not do as well as ford but they still did solidly let's check it out gm on the year up 59.79 percent guys that's a great place to put your money okay a great thing to buy was NEO, okay? Despite everybody that was rah, rah, rah about NEO, that was not the place to put your money. I had mentioned it. Don't sleep on the legacy automakers in the U.S. Go USA. Guys, I think it's going to do it again, okay? It's not going to stop going up. So, yeah, keep that in mind. Another one. Of course, we got to check out Tesla Maesla. We got to check out Tesla Maesla. How much you think that went up, guys? You already know. They, they killed it. You already know. You already know. Tesla on the year. If you'd have bought Tesla a year ago in November, let's slide this all the way back, you would have bought it at about $408 a share. Oh my gosh, I wish I could buy some Tesla right now at $408. What is it today, guys? It's over $1,000 a share. Do I think it's going to double again? 
guys, this is the most valuable part of my video. Yes, guys, yes. I know it's expensive. They may eventually do a stock split, but guys, this is a no-brainer. 150% on the year. Gain. Great place to put your money all day long. From here on, I'm not trading Tesla. I'm buying Tesla and I'm holding it, guys. I wanted to just show you guys the numbers don't lie. They're right here for you. Don't get too caught up in what people are hyping up. Don't forget to put some money in Tesla and your legacy automakers as well. Always diversify, guys. Don't spend money investing that you need for bills and things like that. Do risk management. Check out my link in the description for the Capitalist Academy. You can join your first month for free. Tell them Nora sent you guys. I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for joining me. Peace.